Hello and welcome to Wandering Wanda. I'm Ariel. We're at Space 52 here at Denali Rainbow Village. It's 30 amps, cable, water, and sewer. We do have sewer, but we did have to back in, as you can tell. And with the help of Mark, our wagon master, I'm able to back in with him instructing me through the window which way to turn the wheel. So I still don't really know how to back in myself. I can do it with the help of <laughs> other people. Okay, would I stay in this park again? The answer would be no. Um, most of the sewer sites are all back in and I'm still not proficient with backing in and it is tight quarters. Here's the rig next to us and as you can see parking is very there is no parking you're I'm blocking our other caravanners here on this side and everyone's blocking everyone else I don't really care for that there is just no room and the pull throughs do not have sewer so, and it's not leveled, and it's very muddy. We have galoshes, but that's not why I really, look at this. Our, our, in fact, when I disconnected, the trailer slipped. So, the trailer right now is in an angle, even though I have stable, a little lift things up it's not enough see there's there's a downhill slope there is it's nice and pebbly however when you get in the road area it is very muddy and it's not very secure that's open to a gas station and on this side, it's open to a motel. There's no secure, it's, it, there's no feeling of security here. People just come and go holding beer bottles, walking through. And that's another thing I don't like. The shops directly right behind us, that's the shop. <laughs> Those are the shops from the boardwalk. And people with their beer cans are strolling through here don't like that I don't know if there's laundry facilities I know there is a dump for the ones who are in the middle the shower and bathroom facilities is a mobile mobile trailer I haven't gone in there don't really feel like it I have my own facilities and we're here when it's raining so it's just puddles everywhere so by the time that we're here it's what it is it's part of the tour but again as personally myself i would not stay here again okay horrible horrible we walk into a first store for a coat we are not environmentalists or tree huggers. I love fur. So I ended up buying one. <laughs> Isn't it pretty? It looks fabulous on me. Never a good thing when I walk into a fur shop. And there is Walter paying for it. Okay, this is what it looks like on. Here. Okay, new for color. <laughs> so if I make an ugly face, it's because I only do this about once a year. Oh, okay. 
Are you gonna record the whole thing? I'm recording right now. Oh my god. Cheers, 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 cheers to all of you. Oh my goodness gracious. You're supposed to sip on that and enjoy it. Not tequila. <laughs> I think shots of tequila are supposed to be done in one front row. Why is there not an authority on shots of tequila? Good morning from Denali. We are on our way to the Denali bus tour. It's an eight hour tour, and hopefully, we make it back without getting eaten by bears. Yeah. 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 Walter had to get up at 5 40 this morning. Yeah. 5.40, he got out of bed. Good morning, Joni. Okay, here we are at rest stop number one. It's a flowing river. Now that I've used the bathroom, I can watch flowing river. <laughs> they need to have more bathroom stops. An hour and a half per bathroom when you're on diuretics doesn't work for me. Be happy. I'm happy. Okay, second rest stop. Aren't these mountains beautiful? Even though it's a cloudy day, Denali is still beautiful. bus tour that we took where we are here and then you follow the red line until you get to Elysian you get to Elysian Visitor Center and supposedly there was a view of the mountain over there which is I over here that we did not see. So that was the eight hour bus ride yesterday. Okay, another reason I don't care for this park is because there is an alleyway right here behind our rig, which goes off to the little shops. And also, didn't quite realize it until this morning also, that the upstairs of these businesses are apartments or homes for people. So there's already been someone walking up and down these stairs, which is directly outside of our window. So don't care for that at all. So the view out in the back side of our window right now are just trash cans and all of this, it's just not a pretty view. And again, people are walking right through our campsite, RV site, as if it was nothing. And as far as I'm concerned, we own this space until we vacate it because it's a rental. We are back in the United States. Rental laws apply. Regardless of what state it is, this is a federal thing. And again, people are crunching through here, and I don't care for it. There's a definite lack of privacy, and as far as I'm concerned, security in this park. Again, it's open over here where the gas station is. 
people have just been walking by here to get to the other side where apartments are over here talking out loud after hours holding beer cans drunks I mean I don't mind that but it is an RV park hello and welcome to Denali here we are in Denali Walter is back there talking to you people that from Michigan <laughs> okay Denali yay this is the very first stamp in our book and it's Denali here at Denali very first stamp Okay, very exciting. We have our first sticker stamp of Denali. It was a dollar ninety-five. It's not free. It makes you pay for it. Okay, we're going to attempt to do the Savage River Loop Trail. According to the sign, it's about two miles. So, it should be about an hour. We'll try it. So we're going to end the video for Denali. We are as far as we can drive inside Denali Park. This is Savage River. There are hiking trails that go off to Mount McKinley, which is over there somewhere. I haven't seen it. It's all cloudy. It's been raining here in Denali for the entire time we've been here. Actually, it's been raining since Dawson City. So that's almost two weeks of rain. And we've actually sprung two leaks inside of Wanda. I don't know, it's because the seals are so wet that they're just pouring in now or I've got a leak. We'll figure that out when we get back to Las Vegas. So it's not all roses when you buy a brand new RV, even if it's an Airstream. Two weeks of rain will cause leaks. Very peaceful here. It's beautiful. You can come up here to Alaska, to Denali, visit it. It's absolutely gorgeous. Love the sound of the river. Okay, as far as the rainbow, Denali Rainbow RV Park, I would not stay there again. Again, it's a feeling of security and I don't really feel that secure inside of there because people are walking by, trespassing in your private space that as far as I'm concerned that you rent it out and they're just walking through, trespassing. If you can make it up here to Alaska and visit Mount McKinley National Park, aka Denali, it's absolutely beautiful. Do it. 
do it. Just do it. Come up here. Even though it's been cloudy and rainy the entire time we've been here, it's still a beautiful park. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye.